Hello, I'm KW fans. My name is Braxton Hopkins, your league commissioner, here to bring you the 2023 MKW Award Show. Sadly, we couldn't have people here, but just going to be announcing awards, and we will be calling people to see the reactions of them winning the awards. And we will get into, as we get into that tonight, just to mention now, this will be our last major video of the year. There will be an announcement about uh, something big we're doing during the off season before we head into our next season, and then probably that videos a, a video after those, after the thing that we're doing in the off season, will be an announcement about what's going to change in the league, what's going down, potentially a draft, because we're going to potentially add new players into the league and go from there. But as of now, I bring you the 2023 award show. Let's do it. And now for your first award, it is the 2023 MKW Silver Slugger Award. This player has been absolutely phenomenal throughout the year. No, these awards were all voted on by players in the league. You couldn't vote for yourself, so this is all. Uh, for example, I voted for a person in this. Um, so who won this award? He has been absolutely amazing all year. He's come up clutch, hit a ton of home runs absolutely raked off of teams, probably the best hitter in the league, and had the best stats this year. And I bring you our 2023 Silver Slugger Award winner, Kingston Godzik. Congratulations, Kingston, as we'll see his reaction here in a moment. And with our next award, this will be the MKW 2023 Gold Glove Award, and this player was absolutely phenomenal in the field. And that first year where we thought there was going to be very many crazy plays in the field, but this player made a ton of them, helping out his team in a huge way that led them to a World Series title. So I give you this award to Jay Corcoran of the Montana Leopards. Congratulations, Jay. And now with this next award, it's the MKW 2023 Most Dedicated Award. And this person goes out to who was at, this person was at every single series, helping out and doing things to help out with the production and play. If we needed a designated runner to eliminate the base runner, this person helped as well, and this person did a lot of great things for the league this year, especially helped us be able to finish this first season. And like I said, you couldn't vote for yourself in this award. I did not vote for myself, but I ended up winning the MKW 2023 Most Dedicated Award. Um, I appreciate people voting for me, and I don't know, uh, Cranes on top next year, hopefully, will get the W win the World Series next year, but I appreciate the award and everyone voting for me. So let's get to our next award. And for this next award is our 2023 Cy Young Award. And this award goes to a person that was absolutely dominant pitching on the year. On his team, there were two potentially very good pitchers, and he emerged as the top dog. And whenever they needed him to come in and get some outs, this guy came in and got those crucial outs to help his team go and do do as well as they did and go as far as they did in the MKW postseason. And I give you this award, Kings and Godzik. Congratulations on winning your second award, and this one being the Cy Young Award. Congratulations, Kingston. And this person goes out, and this award is the 2023 Manager of the Year Award. For his team, this captain did absolutely amazing things helped out in ways to help his team win. He was a great hitter, a great all-around player and helped his team. Yeah, he wasn't the star player on his team, but he didn't try to force himself into roles if he wasn't the guy that was going to get it done. And your 2023 Manager of the Year is Thomas Guzdala of the Sailors. Congratulations, Thomas Guzdala. And with this next award is the MKW 2023 Most Improved Award. And this player was someone who was drafted very late in the draft. Um, he excel he started off the year very slow. He, he played on opening day, so maybe that could give you some hints. Um, started off very slow. Then had his he got better every single game of each series. Every single series got so much better. Got invested a ton into wiffle ball and he helped his team win the World Series. I give you the twenty twenty three most improved player of the year. Cooper Ullman, congratulations, Cooper, on winning your award. And this next award is World Series MVP. So this could either be one of six players, the three from the Leopards or the three from the Sailors. And this person excelled to help his team win the World Series, did absolutely amazing things, clutch home runs, clutch pitching, to ultimately secure the World Series sweep. I give you the captain of the Leopards winning this award. The World Series MVP goes to Bennett Bigga. Congratulations, Bennett, on winning your award. And the second to last award is our league MVP. 
And this was the person who was dominant all year. He made absolutely amazing pitches. Like I said, a great pitcher on the mound, a great hitter, great teammate, helped his team win a ton of games this year. Only had two or three, I'm sorry, three losses in total on the year, counting postseason and regular season losses. I give you your 2023 league MVP, Kingston Gadget. Congrats on the Triple Crown Award, or the Triple Crown, winning three awards tonight. Great job, Kings and Gazik. We look to have you back next year. Congratulations. And our last award, bit of a kind of a joke award, but it still means a little bit something. Um, it's our Better Luck Next Year Team Award. So this was a team that just had a lot of heartbreak this year. It, the ball did not fall their way at all this year. This team, they struggled. They were not put in a good spot to succeed as much as uh, manager and all the players and everyone who helped, they just could not get one. And between the four teams we have, our Better Luck Next Year Team Award goes to the Arizona Scorpions. Congratulations-ish on your award. Uh, we hope to have you back next year, even though the 0-11 was not how you guys envisioned the season. Uh, but we thank you for playing in the league anyway. And now our final award, or our far, final thing tonight to send you off so that will conclude all the awards we have for this award show. I appreciate, actually we appreciate all the support you guys and all the fans have had this season. It was a great year. One more hurrah for the Montana Leopards winning the World Series. It was a great year for them. Great year for the league in general. Every team had ups and downs, but ultimately everyone had their success. Um, a big announcement though that we'll be doing during the off season. We will be doing the NKW podcast starring me, Braxton Hopkins, and Jay Corcoran, who you guys saw on the pregame show to most of our series. Um, hopefully it should be a good one, and I hope you guys will pop in for a couple listens on a couple of the episodes. Uh, we'll have special guests every once in a while, basically people we know, part of the league, around the league. Um, but I don't really got to say about the NKW podcast, but one more time, thank you for all the support you showed this season, our last major video of the year. Thank you, and have a good night. Goodbye.